everyone and welcome to Disney Miss Lizzie gameplay. Today I will be playing and exploring the brand new Dreamlight Valley update. I've done the first part of the Olaf quest but today I want to try and find Encanto and try and get that house into the village. So anyway enough chat let's get on with it I'm so excited! <laughs> This is my house. Oh, hi, Scar. Hey. This is my house and village. It's not what I would like it to be. It's a little bit ugly. I've seen others and they're amazing and I don't know how they... Oh! It's a new quest from Scrooge McDuck. You're kindly. Ouch, Lizzie. Good I'm afraid the frosted heights have never drawn more many visitors. I need to learn how to read. They're colder than you can. Of course, if you could make that foreboding frosty place in Little Milk for warm and inviting, I'll make it a perfect place for oh, building a snowman, enjoying a cup of hot cocoa, or going cross country skiing. I'm going to. A. Nobody can turn a piece of real estate like you, Lizzie. Thanks, Scrooge. Right, okay, that's cool. Bye bye! I've also, sorry, I should say as well, I'm halfway through doing Woody's final quest as well. So whilst we're looking for Encanto, I will probably get the bits up for that. So, I'll, oh, actually, I just need to get some rope. Oh, that's not too bad then. Right, let's go do some fishing. Oh, hold on up. Oh, hello, Mons Farm will come up. Oh, what is that? Hello. How? This place is the cat's pajamas. It certainly is, Goofy. It certainly is. What's on your mind? <laughs> Still have ideas for new prank on Donald Duck. Hand squirrel on his hat or put spicy pepper on lunch. But what to do first? Mm -hmm. Squirrel in hat. Stitch is not very nice to prank Donald. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but he does rat! <laughs> so funny. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> That's our class dot. Right, what can I give? I Do I have tinkering parts? I don't have tinkering parts. I don't have white impatience. Oh no, and I don't have chocolate ice cream either. I might have to... Right, sorry I can't talk right now. Right, let's go Thank fishing. You. Let's go fishing. Bye Stitch. Bye bye bye. Let's go fishing. Hey Anna. Oh, no, I didn't want a card, but okay. We are so lucky to have you here. That's okay, Anna. Anna and Elsa will have love. Oh, what a perfect day. Yes! Thank you. Oh, and some red. Seaweed pool. Right, let's go. Oh, actually, I need quite a few seaweed. Right. Oh, right, let's talk to Ola. Hi, it's me, Ola. Hello, Lizzie. I was just going to find you. I'm very happy to be back in the village, but oddly, it doesn't feel right. Oh. It's like something's missing. I just don't know mm. what. You're older and thus all knowing. Could you help me figure it out? I'll try to help. Tell me more, tell me more. Was it love at first sight? <gasps> well, this place used to be full of joy and friendship and warm hugs. Uh -huh. But some of the villagers don't seem happy at all. Like the grumpy lion and the lady who's always looking in the mirror. Grumpy lion and lady's always looking in the mirror. Oh, you must mean Scar and Mother Gothwell. You can't make everybody happy. What have you tried um, to make them happy so far? We'll get a smile out of them, don't worry. We can't make everybody happy. They're hungry for power. If they were happy, a lot of other people in the village wouldn't be. That is very true. <laughs> wow. So you're saying that some conceptions of happiness are at odds with others and maximising the happiness of everyone is practically impossible? Uh, that's a very grown-up thought. Let's keep it simple. 
What have you tried doing to make Scar and Mother Gothwell happy so far? <sighs> well, I tried to give Scar a warm hug. <sighs> but my permafrost got stuck to his fur and he didn't like it. <sighs> then I tried to tell Mother Gothwell some fascinating trivia. Like what? <gasps> I told her that the average human breathes in and out of 22,000 22, times a day. Ugh. She didn't seem to be impressed. Maybe we could try giving them some gifts. That always cheers people up. <gasps> what an incredible idea! I knew you could help me, Lizzie. You have the innate wisdom that comes with maturity. I think I pronounced that wrong. Innate. Me fail English? That's impossible! Hmm. And I know just what to get them. Let's start with some flowers. <gasps> some red bromelades, blue passion lilies, and white passion lilies would make an exquisite bouquet. And of course, we'll need some salmon. Why do we need salmon? Salmon? Why? Just trust me on this one, Lizzie. It's all gonna make a wonderful gift. Oh, actually, Scar. Yeah, it's gone. Why don't you go find everything whilst I figure out what to write on the cards? Ahem. <clears throat> Dear Scar. Next one. Dear Mother Gothwell. Hmm. No. To my most esteemed fellow villager. Oh, cool. thanks. <gasps> Did you this know that hummingbirds so can fly backwards? Right. <clears throat> well, let's go and see if I have a night because I can't remember. It's been a couple of days since I came on here. <clears throat> just because um yeah there's been lots of setting up and stuff which i will explain in a minute i have some dry plants that need watering this probably sounds well but hey it's magical we are the family magical let's go make some rope you should have more than enough yet cool I'm going to make some tinkering parts for Stitch and then I can use that for something else, I'm sure. Right. Craft the blanket for It's doing the thing where it tells you and you've used your items for a different quest. Okay, that's cool. Right. Sorry, I'm just going to quickly change the setup a little bit because I know that every time I'm moving forward, my head keeps getting cut out. So jump cut. So when everything's a little bit more in focus and I'm not sort of being lost. Back in a minute. A few inches later. That's cool. few moments later okay now we're back from that thing i'm just going to check the castle to see if encanto's here i can't see it so far okay the doors haven't changed so that means as far as i know um if not we'll go and do olaf's quest unless olaf leads to encanto but i'd be very surprised if that were to happen and um, the picture for Encanto hasn't come up yet, so we'll see, we'll see. If not, I can always cheat and look up the tutorial, but I'll try not to. I'll try not to, I promise. So anyway, let's, let's go get this salmon for Scar. I'm presuming it's for Scar. Um, I have to get three, blooming heck. All right, okay. So whilst we're here, I'm going to just explain a little bit about the channel and what to expect and what it's about so as you can guess by the name I'm Lizzie and this is a channel dedicated to all things Disney so that will mean looking at not just the traditional Disney films like you know Snow White, Sleeping Beauty, um, Frozen etc. It'll also look at um, the productions that uh, Disney have bought on so there'll be a video coming up about The Simpsons and whether Marge and Lisa would be classified as Disney princesses. There'll also be one where we look at Deadpool and whether Deadpool will be classed as a Disney princess, which I cannot wait. I'm looking forward to making that um, screen cap, actually. I've got a good, good idea in my head, so I'm looking forward to that. Um, 
so yeah, so at the moment I finished on the first script. If I can get everything done, which I'm hoping to, I'm hoping to get the first episode out next Tuesday, which will be the 28th of February, I believe. If I'm wrong, then me remember to put an edit down there to say I was right or wrong. Doing a few gaming videos as well. So this will be a channel that will have scripted videos as well as gaming channels. And what I plan to do, and um, will happen, is I will release a video every Tuesday and Friday. So Tuesday's videos will be scripted stuff, so looking at films, reviews, etc. And then on Fridays will be game days, so um, as well as any Disney Dreamlight Valley updates, which is a good excuse for me to carry on playing it. Um, there will also be looking at Disney classic games. So the next game after Dreamlight Valley will be Mickey Mouse It Takes Two. So I'll be doing that. Also challenging myself to play and finish The Lion King, which I had it when it very first came out, which was a long time ago. Um, very, very long time ago, like 94, so nearly 30 years. And I've never completed it because it is hard. And I've tried on numerous attempts and it's just, nope, I can't do it, it's far too hard. But I'm going to challenge myself to complete it. And that's gonna be interesting because I love gaming, but I'm not necessarily very good at it. Um, which is going to be interesting. So if anyone has any tips or advice on how to beat Lion King, that would be most helpful. So yeah, look out for that. They've also got Hercules coming up. We have, what else do we have? Um, oh, Jungle Book, which I've, ne I've never played. Um, also have Aladdin, which I did finish. I remember playing that constantly. And yeah, so I'm looking forward to revisiting these games and playing ones that I've never actually played before. I have no idea where I'm going, by the way. This is an adventure. Right, I'm going to quickly see where I... Because I can't remember where I get freaking salmon from. Frosted Heights. Oh, look at that, it's Frosted Heights. Ah, I knew it. I knew it, knew it, knew it. I just got that thing. Ah, just trying to get some fish. Hey, Maui. Look at the babbity, 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 babbity. Oh, well, let me see. Oh, you joke it right i have to do a quick yes i know i should have checked before i played the game oh. okay so uh, right whilst i sort out the chests and my inventory i'll tell you a little bit about myself as well and what i got into disney so i've been a disney fan for my first disney princess was the little mermaid and i was obsessed with it so i think every day I would play The Little Mermaid at some point. It would just be on all the time. I just remember Disney being a enormous part in my life. Um, and it still is. It's still a very big part of my life. Oh, right, okay, it's gone back into the chest. Because, right, okay, that's fine. We'll sort this out. One more salmon. Na 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 fishing 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 no oh 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 wait ah no oh you're joking me no 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 oh stupid inventory no let's quickly eat that Right, let's go and let's go and uh, plant some cotton. Let's get rid of that. <sighs> oh, fun! I need to learn how to uh, get money quickly as well. So, any tips that you want to share on how to get the best out of dream life? Like be most appreciated and I've just remembered you need to take a uh, buddy with you so you can increase the friendship of that buddy and I've just remembered that and that's always the biggest tip that comes up is always take a buddy with you so I have to quickly go and find a buddy so I can take that buddy with me uh actually let's go find buzz stitch stitch or buzz it's one or the other 
Let's go, let's go see Buzz. Oh, coins! No, no. Now this came up on TikTok and I had no idea what it was. Okay. I have the golden top. <gasps> it's in Kanto, it's not a potato. Okay. Um oh Right, buzz and then sorry Ilo, if you're gonna have to wait and I, I need to get this house. We don't talk about Bruno. Marlin, come back, 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 come here. Oh. Do you want to give these items? Yes. How oh, marvelous! A golden doorknob with an M engraved on it. Now, this may not look like much, Lizzie, but it's proof your efforts against the forgetting are bearing fruit. I found this lying around the village. Someone must be locked out, so their home. Who belong? Who does it belong to? I thought the local expert on weirdness might know what it is. That's just mean. Someone must be locked. Oh, Ooh. no, 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 no. Not to worry, Lizzie. This golden doorknob belongs to a charming lass named Maribel Madrigal. Oh, I've got to pronounce that right. You wanted her to feel at home, so with my help, you enchanted her house to remind her of where she's from. The enchantment gave the building the power to reflect Maribella's kindness and energy. But even so, we <laughs> never expected Mini Castilla to become quite so magical and so protective of its inhabitant. What do you mean? When the forgetting struck, Marbella, like many of us, started to lose her memories. Then, one morning, her house wasn't there anymore. I quickly went to investigate, and what I discovered astonished me. To protect Marbella, her home disappeared into a small universe of its own. Finding this golden door knock can only mean one thing. Mini Castilla is considering coming back. But first, you'll need to prove to it that the valley is safe once again. I'm ready to do whatever it takes. How do you prove that to a house? So even the buildings are judging me now. Great. Marvellous. Now, houses believe in deeds, not words, and houses often come to resemble their inhabitants. To prove the valley safe for Marabella, you'll have to embody the, Mar the Madrigal's values. <laughs> what are the Madrigal's values? It's because I'm usually singing it, and it's a little bit offer to say <laughs> sorry my fringe is getting on my nerves well i'm told they always believe in bringing their village together to help the community and i remember marabella checking in on everyone here to ensure their needs were fulfilled oh and she also became quite fond of photographs if that helps hmm. i could take some pictures of villagers as for making sure everyone's needs are fulfilled i could check what the villagers needs and give them some gifts fine ideas lizzie and why by simply engaging some of the villagers in conversation might be enough. After all, everyone appreciates being thought of. They do, Merlin. Take this golden doorknob. It's infused with dreamlight. So the more acts of kindness you perform, the more magic it will gain. Once it has enough, Mini Castia will return. I'll give the trial... Oh, sorry, I'll give this a trial run. I'll talk to you once I'm done. Cool, right. Well, track it. Along now. Take pictures with different villagers. Give different villagers their favourite gifts. Oh, right, Mickey, come back. Mickey, come back. Come back, Mickey. Oh, come oh, there, gosh. You know, as an actor. No. <laughs> I've got some to do all sorts of fun jobs. If you're curious about any of them, I'd be happy to tell you. Sorceress Apprentice. Gosh, that one was a lot of work. Carrying all those water buckets was harder than it looked. But it got really fun after I made, I, after I made that big mistake. What mistake? Did it involve brooms? Well, Aww. I tried to do some magic and it kind of got out of hand. Oh, Hot dog! Uh -huh. See your real soul! I'm actually going to sort my outfit out because it's bugging me. Another K top. So right, let's take the coat off. Um, right, stop, 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 where's... 
customize. Here we go. I'm gonna pop a loco for the Debbie the loco. I think Coco is one of my favourite Pixar's films. I love it. I love the colours, I love the storyline, I love the music. Maybe we'll do a review on um, Coco roundabout um, end of October. Do that. The Pixar have been releasing some epic stuff recently. That's Soul. Soul's soul was amazing um there we go yeah, i'm happy with that oh cool right let's get some dream light stuff yeah soul was incredible i loved luca as well really really lovely film Yet to finish turning red. I wasn't that keen on the main character. Well, so I just I couldn't really warm to her. I appreciate what the film's trying to do, and I wish I had something like it when I was younger. But I just didn't really like her. But I think I might be in the minority for that. I don't know. Let me know what you think. Did you enjoy turning red? It's about time. It's about damn time. In a minute, I need a sentimental man of woman. Tell me, a noble leader, what do you enjoy most about ruling over this village? Helping people. Ugh, uh, really, you love helping people. I find it rather tedious. You did then, it. Huzzah. Be prepared. Right, give different villages their favourite gifts. Oh, Stitch! Stitch, where's Stitch? I can give him his tinkering parts. Come here. Come here, Stitch. Come here, come here. Stitch wants coconut cake and coffee! Come here, come here, come here. Come here, little guy. Wow. Right, I have something to give you. There is your tinkering parts. Oh, and I have a Stitch quest, but I'm not going to get distracted. I am going to... Hey, oh, I get a rocket. Cool. Right, I will do that quest after I have completed Encanto. Where's Woody? So this is always a good tip. If you need to find where the villages are, if you go onto your maps and stuff, and you can click on them and it will show them. Oh, there's, there's Woody. Also, if you look on here as well, there's your characters and down to the right one hey there she is um actually i might have that um let me look in my gems i'm pretty sure i did because i started collecting them because i needed more money and i wanted to get some gems so i can build up my village a little bit because i'm not happy start like with my house i really want to change my house oh yep split one cool right let's go and give this to woody boy am i glad to see you um i have something to give you i don't have a shiny okay i'd rather be shiny thanks yeah. oh, <laughs> cool right gotta go and then take the oh wally 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 let's take a picture with wally come back wally Oh, he's adorable. That's cool. And then Eric just photo bombs it. Thanks, Eric. There we go. Oh no, I'm looking miserable. Right, Eric, get out of the way. No, you're not. No. This oh. valley is pretty great. Oh, did that just kill? <laughs> Yeah. Got to Let's talk. see how the golden doorknob reacted to your acts of kindness. Aha! Uh -huh. Excellent work, Lizzie. We're getting closer, but we still need more dream light. What can I do? Oh. The best way to create more is simply to take care of the village. 
If you need a reminder of what you can do, don't forget to gaze into the waters of the plaza well. I'll go do that and check with you later. Oh. I tip my hat Bring to the dream lights a moment. It, cool. I, I, I have a lot of dream lights, so I've been saving this up for ages. Yeah. Yeah. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Just take it. Well, Brilliant, Lizzie. Your hard work has paid off. Mini Castilla is now ready to return the valley. You simply must decide where you wish for Mabella to live and it will appear. Right. Off with you now. This is where I'm also having trouble because I have run out of space in my village and I don't know where best to put things. A lot of it's in the main square, but it's just so cramped. I don't want to necessarily put it on the beach. I might put it here because I, there isn't too much. She says she, there isn't too much furniture. If I put it up here, near the well, and then if I don't like it, I can always change it or something. Um, right, let's actually get the house out, and then we can see what we're dealing with. Right. Da, 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 da. Gosh, that is a big house. Right, I don't want to put it there because that's. I don't want to put it there. Ah, where should I put my house? And there. And there. Let's put it there. I can't put it there. No, nope, okay, there's a massive rock there, right, let's move some of... Can I move any of this? I can move that, I can move the trees. Right, let's move some of these trees. Let's move that. Of course I can't move the rocks because I'm mining. I can't move that, I can't move that. Right, let's move that, okay. Right, let's try again. Nope. Oh gosh. I just want to build a house, man. Six and a half hours later. Okay, right, let's try it now. Why can't I put my house there? What's preventing me? Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> just, ah. Right, cool. Well done, Marabella. Okay, cool. Yay! Okay, cool. Yay! Awesome. Talk to Marabella. Okay, I'll talk to her and then I will end the video here. I'm so happy we actually got to do that because I didn't think we would be able to. I wasn't too sure. Hey! Yorn, where am I? How long have I been asleep? Wait. Am I back in the valley? Much better, and someone made all that darkness go away. You, you must be the one who did it. I'm so glad to be back. Where were you? I'm not oh. sure. It was strange, and everything looked frozen in time. I woke up once to drink a glass of water, but I was so tired, I went straight back to bed. I'm guessing you're the one I should thank for for, for bringing me back. It was my pleasure. It's pretty great how nice it you are. To that's really nice of you to say. Something tells me we're going to be great neighbors. Oh, I'm so happy to see this valley. Before the beginning, it was full of friends, happiness, and so much laughter. Everyone helped each other, just like they do in my Encanto. I really loved it here. That's why I was so sad to see people forget and leave. And then when that darkness fell over everything. But now the darkness is gone. Yeah. There's dreamlight shining on everything again, and I'm back. I can already tell that you're doing amazing stuff here. I can't wait to see what happens. This place really shows that everybody cool. is in their own Bro, way. I went to a Frozen. Oh, uh, Frozen? I went to a Rosa voice from uh, Brooklyn Nine-Nine. Anyway, that's a really good place to stop the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do, then please hit that button, subscribe, 
ding like share this video and don't forget you can also follow me on instagram and tiktok but anyway thank you so much for watching i'll probably do like another quest with marabella finish olaf and finish woody uh, for the next episode so thank you so much have a good day and i will see you very soon bye guys bye